Hello friends, Tony here. Welcome. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to work with uh, Laravel as a backend and, for example, Vue.js or React or Next.js. I'm going to use Vue.js in this example. I have created uh, two projects, the Laravel as a backend and Vue.js as a frontend. And on the Laravel project, I just have displayed here on the slash API slash users uh, some users here, as you can see. And let's see just the route inside the API. I have this route get users and just return user all. Now here we have the ID name, email and email verified, created up and update that because I just said user all. But you can customize this how you want or uh, you can use, for example, I have created this user resource and here I have customized the return only the ID, name and the email and we can use that instead of something like this we can use the user uh, resource but for now let's leave it uh, yeah let's just show you user resource collection and just show you the differences now we have only the id name and the email for each uh, user but just keep in mind this is wrapped with this data okay so we have an object data object and then we have the array with the users we can customize that to go to service provider and say without wrapping the collection but for now let's leave it back and if i refresh we have an array with user objects with all the fields now here I have the front end and as you can see here I have displayed the all the user's name and let's open also the front end to show you here on the home view I created a constant users and use ref user which is this uh, interface user I created this interface with ID name and email and then uh, created a const get users let data await fetch the users from this api slash users from uh, sorry uh, this website here and uh, let's go back then return this response json and assign to this let data variable and then the users value i assigned to this data on mounted i called this get user method and then on the front on the template i just make a v4 and display only the user here okay and we have on the view project something like this render only the usernames here now when i changed to use this user resource for example so let's say let's use the user resource collection and on the backend refresh we have the route with data and we have the objects with only id name and the email but if i come here and refresh because i made that change now we don't see that because uh, as i told you this is wrapped with this data so now on the front end we need to say users dot value to, able, to be able with data but this data has also that wrapped with data which come from a Laravel collection. Now if I make this change and let's see, yeah, now we have the users. So by default, Laravel comes with the front end URL and the port here is 3000. But because uh, the Vue.js, when you create the Vue.js with the Vite, is has this 5173 as a port, now if I refresh, yeah, we lost that because the we have a protection only is going to allow this uh, front-end URL. You can just uh, change this to be uh, 73, 51, 73, for example, and it's going to work. Or if you don't, don't want to make a change here, you can go to view and uh, let's open here the vid and we can customize here to add the server to point to port uh, 3000 instead of 
the 5173 so by adding this here save now let's see let's come here this is not going to work we can change that the port 3000 okay and also on the laravel backend here we are okay to leave that at 3000 refresh is going to work or if you want to leave this uh, 3000 and uh, also the this on something like this which right now is not going to work so if i refresh yeah we need to go to 5173 and yeah we don't see that users you can go uh more deep so for example the course.php in the config we have this course.php and here we have loud origins we have the an array with uh, a valuable with a loud uh, urls we have frontend url to be only the localhost by default is localhost 3000 you can customize here or you can add also the 3000 and the let's say localhost uh, 5173 so 5173 now by default we have this frontend url which is in here right now is 3000 and also here is 3000 or this one uh, because i added here also this one if i go and see refresh now we have the users and the frontend points the 5173 uh, port we can change back to 3000 so let's go and add here the server to 3000 now so with 5173 works also is going to work with uh, 3000 yeah and that's it how uh, easy it is to work with the data from uh, laravel as a backend and Vue.js as a frontend but you can use also react and uh, any frontend is no problem and that's it all about this video friends what i wanted to show you now just keep in mind if you like such videos subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next video all the best thank you very much